Hi guys, this is Sadiq from Droidwin.com and in this video, we'll show you how to bring back the DM message shortcut icon next to a user profile. So earlier, there used to exist the DM icon just left of the notification bell icon from wherein you could just tap on the DM icon and directly send the message to the desired user. However, that has not been removed and you now have to go to the message section and from their section you have to search the user and then DM him or her. That now takes a lot of time. Whereas in the earlier case, there exists a message icon as you could see, it was just to the left of notification icon. You just need to tap on this icon then you could easily send the message to the user. However, it has not been removed from the app after the latest update version. Fortunately, there exists a nifty workaround using which you could easily bring back this option. And in this video, we'll show you how to do just that. So in short, to carry out this task, you'll have to downgrade the app to an older version. So let's check out how this could be carried out. First and foremost, you'll have to uninstall the version that is currently installed on your phone. So for that, go to the settings menu. From settings, go to app and search for the Twitter app. Then go to his app info page. After that, tap on uninstall and tap OK. Let's wait for the app to be removed. So the app is now removed from our phone. And your now next course of action is to download an older version of the Twitter APK. Please make sure to download from a trustworthy site. In our case, we are using the APK Mirror website. Moreover, download a version that is at least a month old. In our case, we will be using the version which has been re released in the month of December 2022. Furthermore, as you could see, there are, are three versions such as the release version, alpha and beta. Please download the release version of this app as it's the most stable. Moreover, once you go to the download section, it will show you something along the following line. As you could see, it's not exactly an APK, but an APKM or the APK bundle format. As is mentioned here, so it contains split APKs as well. So to install such an APK, you will need to install the APK Mirror application as well. So go to Play Store and simply search for the APK Mirror installer app, then install this app from Play Store as well. Once you have done that, you could now download the older APK of the Twitter app. Once downloaded, simply launch the APK file and then select the APK Mirror installer file as that we have installed from Play Store. So select this and we will now be installing the Twitter app using this app itself. So just tap on install app and it will now show you an ad. So let's bypass this ad quickly. So we are so we are done with the app and with the ad and it will now bring up the install section. So tap on install and it will now be installed onto your phone. The process should only take a few seconds at the very max. As you can see the app has now been installed. So you could open the app from here itself. Now sign into the app using your account. So let's do that as well and as you could see we are now into, logged into the account and let's now search for a user let's say Droidwin and check out the results so as you could see let's select this icon and as you could see we have now re got the DM icon once again so we could just tap on this DM icon and then just send the DM to the user of your choice and hit OK and that's it guys apart from that your last course of action is to disable the automatic updates of this app from Play Store. If you don't do so, then Play Store will update the app to the latest version and the DM icon will again be removed. So go to Play Store, search for the Twitter app, then tap on the overflow icon in the top right and uncheck enable auto update. With this, the app will no longer be updated on your phone and it will stay on this version itself. And you could now continue to enjoy the, this app version and use the app with the DM icon as I have shown you below. So guys, just to re-verify, as you could see, we are now getting the DM icon and even if you close the app and force stop it, the icon will be there itself. Let me show you once again. So let's force stop the app and then relaunch the app. If I open the app again and search for this user, you could see the app is still there and the icon is still there and you could now interact using the shortcut key. So guys, this was all from this video on how you could bring back the DM shortcut icon. If you have any queries, do let me know in the comment section and please subscribe to your channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks a lot for watching.